Welcome back to Wasteland 2. There are many different pathways I can go from here. So we're in the area surrounding the prison. I think this is surrounding the prison, right? I don't think we've actually entered it yet. And over here are some red scorpions, which may start shooting me if I get near, or maybe I can talk with them and make something happen. I'm not sure. Red is up here on Goat Hill, who is protected by these turrets, which can only be disabled by entering a correct password at this console. And we just open up a pathway over here by um, hacking or whatever we did with this crane to open up this. I'm pretty sure this goes to the prison, right? Yeah, okay. So that goes to the prison. Which implies that the entrance is hidden or protected. I suppose the other entrance is probably behind all these red scorpions up here. And they're controlling it. And I just found a back entrance. So I don't know if I just want to go to the prison uh, or what. I mean, the reason I need to find Red is because he's the one that can tell me about how to get a good rad suit to go past the radiation clouds to get to DeMonta, which is where I need to go to set up the repeater, right? Yeah. He's the one that knows how to get through the radiation clouds. So Red is the person I need to see to continue past this place. So I think I could probably be okay by just going to him last. I don't think I need to go to him right now. However, there is something I want to try. One thing I can't remember whether I tried or not is whether I tried to hack this thing. Okay. It's, that's weird. It's a computer terminal. It requires a password, and I can't even attempt to hack it. That's really weird. Okay, the other thing is that somebody mentioned that uh, one of the passwords I attempted to enter was preferred. And if you enter a password that is actually one of the passwords that was given to you, for example, what was it? Wasn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Yeah, access code expired. So if it was once a password, because apparently it's a password that changes very often, if it was once a password, it recognizes it. So the fact that it's saying it doesn't even recognize it means that it never was a password. Which is weird, because somebody actually specifically told me in the game that is the password. That's what he said. At the time, it was preferred. So, it should recognize it. But, as somebody pointed out, Preferred actually has two R's. Which is true. Now, before I say anything else, though, let me just try that. Access code expired. Okay. So, it does have two R's. However. I feel like I must defend my honor here, because I thought, wait a minute. I wrote down the password. I wrote down Preferred. Right when I saw it. I looked at the text and wrote it down. So how could I spell it wrong? So I actually went back in one of my in in the video where it happened, and I looked at it and I didn't spell it wrong. In the text, it was actually spelled with one R. So, yeah, blame them, not me. I spelled it exactly like they said. In fact, actually, how they spell it is in all caps. That's how it was spelled. Preferred with one R, but uh, I don't think it's case sensitive. Oh, no, it is case sensitive. Yeah. All caps preferred with two R's uh, apparently does not work. Unless I misspelled it. No, I didn't. All right, it, it is case sensitive. Anyway, all of that is to say I still don't have the password. Well, we'll see if it drops out of the sky somewhere at some point. Uh, if not, I suppose I could always... Well, one of my thoughts is maybe I can dress everybody up as a goat. And since it is Goat Hill, maybe the turrets will recognize me as friendly? Perhaps. Or maybe if I simply have a goat in my party, I might be okay. I could go get, uh, what was his name, Aberforth? The new shop mascot back at Hypel. Okay, uh, oh! Wait, so they're actually going to kill me. Okay, good. Well, the rangers pay their taxes? Ah, see? Let them pass. Yeah, yeah, I'll be careful. Got paperwork to deal with and blah, blah, blah. Radio isn't working. Wait, your radio isn't working? I guess I can't tell the others you paid your taxes. You're more than welcome to pass here. I wouldn't if I were you, but feel free to pass. Oh, thanks. Ha, 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 ha. Fuckers. 
Is he even being serious when he says his radio isn't working? Or is he just pulling my leg? I can't tell. Without, you know, without actual voice acting, it's hard to tell whether he's being sarcastic. I want to just kill them all. I really want to just kill them all. Well. Let's see if... Uh, can I just open these things? I mean... I don't see any indication that it's stealing. Damn. Yeah, they don't care. Okay. I'm <laughs> just stealing right in their vision. You know, right in front of them and they don't care. Damn, that's a lot of ammo. Farmer's Diary Part 4, Laser Carbine, damn! Mm, do I have any other parts of the Farmer's Diary at the moment? Oh, Part 1. I must have... Yeah, I must have forgotten to read this or something, because I don't think I read this. Hmm... Let's wait until I get more parts. I mean, there's at least four parts, because I have part one and four. Let me see if I can find two and three before I start reading. Probably make more sense that way. An alarm. Okay. Okay, but they already know I'm here, so would the alarm actually do anything? Hold on, I'm gonna test the game... I'm gonna test the game's logic. Theoretically, they already know I'm not an enemy, so the alarm shouldn't do anything. They already know I'm here. So, yeah, let's let's just try this. I will load my game if they start trying to kill me, because that'd be stupid. It's stupid that I can steal right in front of them, but they've already established that that's okay, so the alarm shouldn't really do anything, given the rules they've already established. Don't fuck me over, Wasteland. I don't hear the alarm yet. A Bren. It's a heavy whip on. Army issue backpack. Whoa. Huh. Increases carry weight and lowers combat speed. Do I have anybody that doesn't really need to move? Uh, suppose my snipers. But do I really need more carry weight that bad? Not really. Okay, <laughs> the alarm didn't even go off. All right. That's to the prison. Hmm. There's a toaster that I'm sure I cannot fix because my skill is only one in it. Who has the toaster repair? It's Harper. It's impossible. Can I get like a... Like a Pop-Tart trinket that increases my toaster repair skill by one? Really? There's like one pixel by which they can travel here. Like grains of sand in an hourglass. Okay, well, where do I want to go now? I can go into the prison, although apparently that's a bad idea. I have an idea. Let's go spelunking. Where was it? Here. Yeah, so this is all, that's... This is the place where the girl mentioned them raping her pigs. <laughs> I remember that. That sticks in your mind. Do, do, do. It's Goat Hill. Yeah. And then here is where I shot... I uh, mercy killed that woman. And here is a cave that I want to enter. Snarly caves. Probably full of woof woofs. Faster! Mush mush! Oh god, they're going back across the hourglass thing, I think.
Mmm, 60 FPS scrolling. So smooth and silky. It's been like a week and a half since I've played this game. Hopefully I can remember how to combat. Oh, no, it's not wolves. It's honey badgers. And it has a height advantage. Oh, there's more. Yep. When well, there's one badger, there's always more. Got this fiery, firing line going on. Everybody kneel, except for Takayuki, because you're a melee dude. Sniper takes the first shot. Just ambush? Hmm. I think I'm gonna wait for it to come closer so I don't waste ammo on it. Nah, we don't need to worry about wasting ammo. We just picked up a bunch. It's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna leave them on non-burst, though. You can move forwards. <laughs> ah, just out of range. Yes. They've fallen for my trap. Hm. Giant toads in here, too. Let's use up our shotgun ammo, shall we? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's something more in there. Okay, there's more. Never mind. Because these are actually pretty easy enemies. Damn, they can move for a really long time. This wasn't make sense. Long legs and all that. I probably could save ammo. I don't care that much. I'm not gonna burst fire, but... Yeah, so I'll be mildly ammo conservative. I won't burst fire, but... Other than that, I'm not gonna worry about it. Save a little bit here, yeah. Just use a shotgun to finish it off. Let's get this dude some action. Don't want everything to be dead before he gets a chance to slice it up. died anyway. There's a... Wait, there's a pipe bomb on this frog? 
Or toad? Alright. Where did it keep it? Ooh, looks like Theodore leveled up. Electronic lock. Oh, really is overburdened. Oh, electronic lock. It's a job for Harper. Whoops. Ah, uh, yeah, she's got tons of huge weapons and explosives. Yeah, not doing too bad on ammo. Okay, let's give the weapon to somebody else. Let's distribute the explosives, actually. There we go. Level up. Copy, Echo One. Level Lupe. Echo, congratulations, Echo One. You've done with. Hmm. Leadership is always good. Kiss ass is definitely high enough for now. Don't find myself using field medic or anything like that very much. I could just make him better at shooting, but no. No, I'm not going to do that. That's not what he's about. He's not a combat character. I, I want to do surgeon because he, you know, he's my medic dude, but... I just haven't really used it. Uh, it's too field medic. Even though I don't think it does much. Jesus Christ. These things are so heavy. I need to sell them. I'm getting so many energy weapons, it seems suggestive of the fact that I'm probably going to have to start using them soon. Ooh. Ooh. Waste wolves. Ah, they're not too bad. I'm like a 60 hit points. Look at the drool coming out of their mouths. Come on, let me get everybody into position before everything starts. Nope. Almost. Should get him further away. Yeah. There we go. Much better. That is not a clean shot. Let's move here. Maybe I can shoot in between them. Cool. <laughs> Yulia's getting gnawed on. Ooh, perfect. Well, not quite perfect. I guess if I want to hit them both, I have to move. Alright, that's fine. Let's move. Oh, shit. Damn it, Harper! What idiot told you to stand there? Well, shit. C can I just not shoot? I, I just can't shoot, can I? You know what's funny is apparently Yuli has never heard of the concept of aiming down. She just doesn't know how to aim down. 
She has to aim always shooting outwards. She can't aim down. Yeah, I, I can't. Well, that was wonderful. Not my finest tactical decision. There we go. Got a super high chance to crit with this thing. Yep, critical hit chance, 44%. Nah, I'm not going to waste a sniper round on that. Who's going to go next? Yeah, Yulia can get the dog. Let's go for the badger. Oh, <laughs> I killed the dog accidentally. You're such a bad shot, you accidentally killed an enemy. Thing's almost dead. Let's just use Yulia's shotgun ammo. Let's go. Oh shit! Is this an alternative entrance to Goat Hill? I see goats, and this looks like. Yep. Yep, this is a Goat Hill. Excellent. I don't even need the password. Oh shit. Oh. I thought it was a mine. Oh no, it is a mine. We just barely. Didn't hit it. Okay, now Yulia just needs to gingerly clip the right wire and not freak out when a goat, you know, suddenly goes. Alright, that's a pretty good one, but I was hoping for the human scream. There you go. So just don't worry about the blood curdling screams, Yulia, okay? This is a critical failure. I think the goat's gonna blow up. Alright, let's go slow. Maybe that's what this is for, actually. Hoping that people would accidentally hit it to blow up a goat, and then maybe Red hates you if you blow up one of his goats or something. Wait a minute, why would you put down landmines where goats are? Like, are the goats smart enough to avoid them? There's no way they are. Gonna end up with a lot of dead goats. There's more. These goats are freaking me out. Yeah, they're freaking me out too. <laughs> they even make noise in sync. Oh god. I'm gonna try talking to them and see if I can animal tame them or something and get a huge following of goats. But after I defuse some more of these... I feel like they're guarding this. Look at this. It's like they're at the entrance. I feel like that's trapped. No, it's fine. Alright. Let's try talking to them. They just scream. Let's try converting them. Oh, I can. Can I get all the goats? Am I gonna have a goat following by the time I get to red? Oh my god. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. 
We shall be the Goat Masters. Gotta go slow, though. We don't want to blow up our goats. This poor goat's practically trapped by this landmine. Oh my god, they're gonna be screaming every second behind us. This is going to drive me nuts. And there is red. Oh my god. How many goats do I have? Wait a minute. I whoa, whoa, whoa. I lost some goats. What the hell? Oh, maybe you can only have three at one time. Yeah, let's... wait. Oh yeah, I can only have three, I think. For some reason, I can't even tame them anymore. Alright. Three will have to do. How you doing there, Red? What are you hitting? What is that? That's a speaker. Like a broadcasting, like public broadcast speaker thing. A weathered man appears to be struggling with a piece of scrap metal. Huh? Rangers? How the hell did you get in here? We came in the back way. Through the caves. Damn it. I keep meaning to block that off. Get all kind of vermin coming in that way. Well, you're here now. So what do you housebreakers want with an honest businessman? What is your business? I buy and sell scrap metal. Have you got any or want any? What's trade? Well, before that, let's ask about DeMonta. What do you know about DeMonta? What makes you think I know anything about DeMonta? Never heard of it. Oh, come on. Everyone says Red knows about DeMonta. Okay, okay, I've heard of it. It's off to the east, but it ain't easy to get to. Need a rad suit to get through the wall, or you'll fry like a chicken. And get through what wall? You know, the wall of radiation to the east of here. There's a thin spot a ways northeast of the prison, but you still need rad suits to get through it. How do you find this thin spot? All you gotta do is listen for the Mad Monk's broadcast. They give the coordinates and landmarks so you can find the right spot. Where can we hear this broadcast? Can't really hear it until you get east of the prison, but it gets stronger as you get closer to the wall. Just tune in your radio and you'll hear them loud and clear. And who are these Mad Monks that give the broadcast? Are the crazy bastards that rule the canyon between here and DeMonta. They help traders pass through and keep them safe on the way. Just don't get on their bad side. They'll blow your ass up. Any rad suits around here? Can't say I can lay my hands on any just now, but there was a ranger came through here on his way back from DeMonta recently. Bechowski? Something like that. Where is Bechowski? A bunch of rangers arrested him and took him away. I look for him in that mass graveyard you rangers dump everybody in after you arrest him. Her, her, her. <laughs> just kidding. He's probably just locked up back at the Citadel. Maybe if and you ask him real nice and let him out of jail, he'll tell you what he knows. Was well, there somebody named but Bachowski? Back at the Citadel? Maybe it was so recent that I, I must have missed him or something. I don't know. Okay, well, sounds like I might be heading back to the Citadel. Prematurely. But before that, what do you have? Oh. What a surprise. You sell scrap. 
Is that, wait, is scrap metal different from scrap? Because scrap is m money. Is scrap metal different from scrap? It is. Well, that was a bad exchange. Bought it for ten and sold it for three. Alrighty then. Have a good day. Actually, wait a minute. I should probably sell my junk. He has to lighten our load a bit, but we're not selling our pet rock. Hell no. That's staying. Click clacks. Happy Valley brochure. Yeah, I guess I'll ditch it. Yeah, I can dump all this stuff. Oh. Damn it, you're too poor. Okay. Let's keep our click clacks. Keep our click clacks and our knick knacks and our LDs. Keep a phone. Alright. Goodbye. Watch out for my preferred customer. Welcoming system if you leave from my front gate. Gotcha. The goats got rather quiet. Ooh, Farmer's Diary Part 3, just need Part 2. Okay, I'm guessing this is the same console as on the other side. Preferred customer welcoming system deactivate. Oh, I guess we're good. Wait, so we have to lockpick our way out of here? He's not even doing us the service of unlocking his own gate? Okay. Don't mind a little bit of bonus XP. Hello, turrets. I can shoot them while they're deactivated. I guess that's it. I was expecting more from Red. But, uh, yeah. I mean, he did tell me a lot of valuable information. Like about the mad monks and the thin spot, and I should go take talk to Bechowski back at the Citadel. Yeah. Some good, vital information. So, I think that's it for out here. So, uh, it's either back to the Citadel or to the prison. Yeah, one or the other. I guess there's no need to go back to the Citadel unless I want to go to DeMonta, so I, I guess I might as well check out the prison. Try to fix things here before I move on. Because there's probably not a reason to actually come back here if I just want to get to DeMonta. I think I've gotten all I actually need from here. So I'll probably go to the prison next. Alright, well, I think I'll end this episode here. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.